Professor Puffin here from Loki University. Welcome back to Loki. This is the It's Not Rocket Science edition um, of Explaining Being Woke. It's not rocket science. It doesn't take a rocket scientist to understand being woke. You know, you know what it does take a rocket scientist to do is to make rockets. So I might know a little bit about rocket science, but I don't need to know everything about it because I'm not making rockets. Now, who does need to know what being woke is? Anybody can know what being woke is. People of any intelligence level, no matter how smart you are or pretending to be or pretending not to be, you can understand being woke if you want to. If someone's trying to get you to explain it and refusing to understand, they're just trolling you and wasting your time. Um, the people that need to be woke, I mean, it wouldn't hurt for everyone to be woke. It would be a nice world if everyone was woke, because being woke just basically means caring about other people. But the people who absolutely need to be woke are the people in positions of power. So, who needs to be woke and for what is if you have any control over anybody else's life so people in political positions of power running businesses organizations really at any level um, it would be much better if those people were woke if someone is in a position of power like a republican and they're anti-woke then they're basically just raising their hand to say you know i shouldn't be in this job and we should assist them out of those positions by electing other people to those positions and either getting people to be woke or replacing them with people who are but we don't need to be wasting time on people who are just trolling us by pretending to not understand things that are really obvious um, and we should focus those efforts on educating and waking up people who are in positions of power or replacing them or letting people who are already woke know other things they can do to help everybody out thank you